So listen to this. Watch as the juice comes out. <laughs> it's definitely my personal fave out of the two. Mm, that is so good. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Marie and I'm so glad that you clicked on today's video. If you know me, you know that I love juicing. If you've been subscribed to my channel for a while, I have actually shared so many recipes for smoothies, but recently in the past months, I have just been on this juice kick. I actually used to buy them made until I found a way to start making them myself. Today I will be sharing with you two of my favorite recipes for juices. I'll be first showing you how to make them and then we're gonna come back in my room and talk a little bit about all the benefits that this really does give you. Like this video if you enjoyed it and if you want me to make more videos like this. Also don't forget to subscribe. I do post every Monday at 12 p.m. EST. Now without further ado, let's just go ahead and get started. So let's head down to the kitchen and I am going to show you guys how to make these juices. We have made it to the kitchen so today I'll be showing you how to make my favorite red juice. We have carrots, pepper, orange, lemon, ginger, red apple, and the star of the show is beets. The first step is going to prep all of this to juice. So you want to take the skin off of everything, wash it, and chop it up into small pieces. I have a question for you guys. Do you guys wash your produce and then chop it? or do you chop it and then wash it? I actually chop everything and then wash everything. Let me know in the comments below. By the way, you guys, don't forget to compost. If you guys were wondering why I have a full bowl of fruits and veggies here, that is actually because I like to meal prep my juices. As you can see, juicing does take a little bit of time to do. So that's why I got these really cute bottles on Amazon. So basically, I will make just enough to fill them all up. And so my juices are ready for the week. This is really good because you can take it on the go. You can drink it on your way to work. Or just if you're going to do some errands, this is a must. They were super affordable. I will have them linked down below. So I have peeled, cut, and washed all of my produce so we can finally get started. This is really the longest step. So when you get through this, the rest is super easy. So there are many different ways to juice. I used to actually put all of my produce into my Nutribullet, blend it all up, and then strain it with a nut bag. I have upgraded recently. If you have a KitchenAid mixer, this is going to be perfect for you. Basically, I just bought an attachment to go into this mixer, and it's a juicer. Here it is, it is super easy to use. I will link the mixer and the attachment down below in the description box. I did get everything from Amazon. Here we have my KitchenAid mixer. I am just going to put this attachment in here. And then it comes with these two containers. So you have one container for the juice and then one container for all of the fiber. And then finally, we have this little piece right here that we're gonna use to really push everything in. It's so simple. I'm gonna show you guys how this works. I usually like to put it on the number two speed. And that is it. Watch as the juice comes out. <laughs> So the carrots and the apples are done. So this right here, I am going to compost. As for the juice, we're gonna transfer it into this little glass here so we can make room for the rest of our produce. So here is the rest of the juice. I'm just gonna pour it in. There you go, and here we have our red juice. Now we're just going to transfer all of this into here. And here we have it, our red juice. So it was enough to make four bottles and then I had a little bit extra 
extra so I put it in this little glass to try out with you guys so cheers mm, that is so good I really like ginger so I put a lot so you definitely taste it if you're not the biggest fan of ginger just put a bit but I definitely recommend putting it in there because there are just so many healthy benefits and there you have it that is how to make a juice now let's head back upstairs and I'll speak to you guys all about the benefits okay we are back now I really want to get into why this is so important and just amazing for you so you guys just saw how I make my red juice but I also want to share with you my recipe to make my green juice on Instagram I posted a reel on how I make that green juice so I'll post it right now but basically for these two recipes you kind of have to follow the same rules okay so listen to this for each one you need four main ingredients that should always be there those are the four things that are really a necessity in these juices and for the rest you are going to take whatever is in your kitchen that is about the same color to make the green juice you are going to need these four main ingredients that is celery cucumber ginger and lemon what I love to do is look, open up my fridge and kind of see maybe what is close to going bad. So if I have spinach, parsley, cilantro, green apple, really no matter what it is, I will take it and put it in that juice. Now for my red juice, the four main ingredients that you want to have is one, beets, oranges, ginger, and carrots. Once again, Open up your fridge and see whatever is about the same color. So if you have red apples, red peppers, definitely take those two. Now, how do you decide? Why drink a green juice and why drink a red juice? Now I'm going to explain you what each of these offer you and when you should take each. Let's start off with my green juice because it's definitely my personal fave out of the two. Green juice is great for detoxing that's really what i refer it to when i drink a green juice i instantly feel like it is just cleaning out my system i don't know how to explain this feeling to you but if you have drank green juice yourself you will know what i'm talking about the green juice really does help with inflammation that is what i really take it for i'm feeling bloated and i'm having some digestive issues maybe i'm not as regulated as i normally am or like i said i'm bloated green juice is definitely the way to go Every ingredient, the celery, cucumber, ginger, and lemon, those four things have anti-inflammatory properties that are going to directly target your digestive system. Of course, it also helps to clear your skin, it promotes hydration, and just so many benefits. What's great about juicing is that because there is no fiber, it is very quickly absorbed into your system so basically your system won't have to take extra energy in order to digest all of those fibers because it's just not there and it's basically just water and vitamins that are going into your system your cells are going to soak it up and it really is just like a boost of vitamins so that is why i love taking my green juice now for the red juice there are different reasons why i like to take this one i want to specifically talk about beets which is definitely the main ingredient in this juice before i actually did my research i didn't know how healthy beets were for you i mean i know all fruits and vegetables are obviously amazing for you but beets specifically you guys now that i know this i have been eating them so much more often beets have so many vitamins so i will list them all here but they include manganese copper potassium magnesium vitamin c vitamin b6 and iron all these vitamins are super duper important and not every vegetable or fruit has this many vitamins a lot of them will have maybe two, three, but this is one that just has a ton. Next up, we have orange. And this is actually something that I also like to put in my green juices sometimes, just because of the 
amount of vitamin C that is in oranges. Vitamin C has so many benefits, but there are two specifically that I really love. Number one is that it helps to boost your immune system. So that's the first reason why I love vitamin C. And of course, during these times, we definitely need some immune boosting. Another reason why I love vitamin C is because it helps the body to produce collagen, which helps smooth out your skin. So when I am feeling like my skin is congested and I'm kind of breaking out, I will definitely opt for this type of juice and then of course there is also ginger in, in this juice which is just amazing for inflammation and finally we have carrots another vegetable which is just amazing for you carrots are actually very high in vitamin a so for people who are having trouble with their vision carrots are definitely a must i don't necessarily have trouble with my vision but it's still good to know that i am getting those benefits it improves your digestion and it can also help with weight loss so there it is those are my two favorite juices that i have been absolutely loving i have my green juice and my red juice and i really switch between the two depending on how i'm feeling that's it for today's video i really hope you guys enjoyed it and learned something new please give it a big thumbs up if you did it will really help my channel out a lot also don't forget to subscribe and stay tuned for all my future videos that's it for today thank you you guys so much for watching and i'll just catch you in the next one bye